What's up? It's Jerry Brown again, and I'm here to show you the seven steps that I use to sell your home. All right, so once you've made the decision to sell your home, do yourself a favor and choose a realtor with a real marketing plan. Any good realtor should be able to share that plan with you. I'm a good realtor, so I'm gonna share with you right now. Pricing and positioning. No matter how well I market your home, if it's not priced right, it's not gonna sell. If you price too low, you're gonna leave money on the table that you worked so long and hard to build. If it's priced too high, it's just gonna sit there and grow gray hair. Price it right, sell it quick. Staging and decluttering. Making your home show ready is crucial for maximizing the value. Nobody wants to walk into a hoarder house and nobody wants to walk back to the future and think they're gonna to have to bid against Biff Tannen. No. Nope. Amazing pictures. All right, so this day and age, your home's first showing is gonna take place online. My marketing team includes a professional photographer and videographer to make sure that your home shows well no matter what type of device they're looking on. They always say that the camera adds 10 pounds. So why don't you let the camera add 10% to your selling price? Online marketing. So the top four real estate websites, the Zillow, Trulia, Realtor.com, and Homes.com get close to 100 million views per month. Our marketing focuses on those four websites as well as YouTube. Our marketing dude is an expert in SEO and frequently ranks our videos on the first page of all the search engines. We also make extensive use, I can't say extensive, we also make extensive use of social media. Can you say, hashtag Chicago Real Estate? list on the MLS. All right, one of the most important creations in the real estate world was the MLS, or multiple listing service. Think of it as the Amazon.com of the real estate industry. When people are shopping for homes, they're going on the MLS because all the websites get their information from there. Offline marketing. As important as the internet is for marketing your home, there's an equal need for offline marketing as well. A for sale sign in the yard will get the interest of prospective home buyers and let everybody know that your house is on the market. Sometimes a nosy neighbor can be your best marketing tool. They know the area and they know why people want to move there too. Or I could just dance in your yard. Create a buzz. All right, with all of these marketing efforts, the most important step in the process is to listen to the market and adjust accordingly. I'm gonna be on the other agents and the potential buyers like a spider monkey. Thinking about selling your home? Do you know somebody thinking about selling a home? Call me, text me, email me. Throw a note in the bottle. Whatever. My name is Jerry Brown from Fulton Grace Realty, and I'm out.